Hello, my name is Lincoln. I'm going to show you how to upgrade all the major components in your computer. Let's go. You're going to want to find a empty static working surface, so like a box will do. And then you just want to start by taking out your motherboard, not grabbing it by the PCB. Just put it on that piece of thing, put it on your cardboard. And to install your CPU, it's the same for, it's pretty much the same for AMD and Intel. You're gonna push this down, slide it out to the right, and push it up. And then that one thing will come up. And then you're gonna wanna take your CPU right here. You're gonna find this little golden triangle right there, and find a little golden triangle right here. Line them up and drop them in. And just like that, you can pull a tension lever down. This takes a little bit of force, but just be confident with yourself, you can get it. And then just like that, you have your CPU installed. All right, moving on to RAM. You're gonna want to take these back, like so. So, so for DDR3, for some of them, you only have to push these tabs back, or these, but for this one, you have to push all of the tabs back, like so. And then you're gonna want to take your RAM modules, find a little notch. Here, let me get a little, show tool. I'll find the little notchy thingy right here. Five, do this one. You wanna do the ones farthest away from the slot first and click those in and then the next one you're going to want to do and then if you only have two sticks of ram you want to do this channel and this channel so that way you get the max amount of speed out of your memory so i'm just going to put this stick in right there like so and then since i have two more sticks of ram i'm just going to put it in these two as well. Okay. Next step. If your CPU cooler, if your CPU cooler screws directly into a back plate with your motherboard, you're gonna want to install that now. But if it doesn't like mine, which I don't have a back plate, everyone, you're going to want to go ahead and get your case out. Then we're gonna take your case and just like start to like take the unneeded things out. It's like that little shroud, this little optical drive. I don't need that right now. Um, I don't need. Pick your board back up and do go I/O first. Just when I get it nice and lined up put the motherboard in the case <laughs> then you just want to screw all your little standoff screws in so next step is i'm just going to reroute these cables so they're not in my way just plug them all in right now okay now for a thermal compound i just broke that plastic down and i you want to grab your thermal compound. In this case, I'm using Corsair TM30. You can use just about any thermal compound. You can find it for about five bucks on Amazon. And you're gonna just want to do like a little like dot about the size of a pea. So about yay big. Then you're gonna want to take your CPU cooler and figure out where this cable needs to go. So in my case, I have a pretty short cable. So yeah, you're gonna find. So you're gonna find where your cable goes. So mine goes right here and it's pretty short. So I'm gonna line it, so I'm gonna make sure this is as close as possible to that. So I'm just gonna line it up, line it up with the standoffs. Make sure it's snugly in place. And slot this little itty bitty cable in there. All these screws and just screw it in. All right, so. That's about all we've got. So the final step is you want to take any cables that you had 
that you unplug while you're doing this. So like I've got this, I've got two SATA cables. And it's gonna kinda just very effortlessly cable manage. It's all in, like so. And you wanna take all the accessories you took out at the beginning, it's like your shroud. Throw it back in here. Throw him in there. Take your hard drive case that I just got at the beginning. So now if you had like an old hard drive, you would take one of these SATA datas, plonk it in there, and one of in your SATA power and plonk it in there too. But I don't have a hard drive at the moment, at this moment in time. So I'm just not gonna bother with it. So just like pretend I plugged that. And I'm just gonna put Mr. Side Panel back on. Like that. And you are in the, you've officially upgraded a computer. So if you've made it this far, thank you for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.